Hey guys, welcome back. Well, today I'm here with the ZLRC SG906 Beast. Now, you guys probably seen me review this one a few months back. I think I reviewed this back in May. And I've done a full uh, overview and review of this one. Well, today I'm going to test out how far the Wi-Fi FPV app will uh, actually give a signal. I'm in the same uh, field on the foreshore here uh, that I was flying my Femi A3 and where I tested out the distance of the Wi-Fi on the SJRC F11. Now, the only drawback about this particular drone is that this one does not come with an SD card. So I'm just gonna fly this out to when the Wi-Fi FPV, the 5G Wi-Fi, actually starts freezing up on me because I don't want to fly this one blind. Now I believe, looking at the specs, the Wi-Fi FPV range on this should be around 300 to 350. So that's just one thing that I was curious about testing today. So I've um, got the controller here. I'm gonna set up the app, calibrate the drone, and let's uh, give it a go. See how far the Wi-Fi FPV on this drone will uh, reach in meters. So I've got sufficient satellites here, 14 it says on the controller, so send it up. Hopefully it's starting to record something. And we'll send it out. Rather windy here today. And this has had an update, apparently, this, uh, this app. So I'm just going to sit there for a second. Now, 
This thing's got some pretty decent range, guys. Stop the 658. Okay, I'm going to hit the return to home. And it's saying going home. So it's got 650 metres of range, guys. 657, nearly 660. That's pretty good. The Wi-Fi FB, the Wi-Fi FPV is really laggy. It's still showing me going out that way, so. The distance is coming down, it's 494 now. So this is a, that's the full distance of this. meters away should be seeing it in view pretty soon and I can see it she's coming she's coming back I'm only at uh, about 38 metres altitude. So let's see how accurate the return to home is on this. So she's slowing down, she's coming. She's coming down here now. Just about over my head. And there's a whole swarm of bees, guys. Massive swarm, actually. <laughs> so this is gonna be on the recording for sure. Massive swarm of bees around it. Let me see if I can turn around towards them bees, so you can see them, they're all over it, actually I think they're wasps, I don't know, no they're bees, and they're getting chewed up, something shocking, <laughs> okay, now they're all, they all took off as soon as it landed, so, it's landed about, I can't show you because this Wi-Fi FPV is really laggy as you can see, look how laggy it is. Um, the, the quadcopter is about two metres away from the helipad, so uh, uh, good test, that was a good test. So um, as we can see, the uh, this uh, beast drone reached a maximum um, range of around uh, nearly 700 meters, 660 meters, which is pretty impressive. Not too bad at all. Now the Wi-Fi FPV looks like it did last that distance as well because I'm seeing it on this playback as it's trying to keep up with the actual flight and uh, it looked like the Wi-Fi FPV actually went the distance. So, Thanks for watching guys, I'm going to add a clip at the end of this flight because I actually have to wait for this to play out um, so I can finish this recording so I'll add a clip at the end of this of the actual flight itself, flight footage from the camera of this uh, so thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed this distance test on the SG906 Beast drone from company ZLRC. I might put a link below to this one. It looks like it has improved uh, as far as um, the behavior of this quad since I reviewed it um, all the way out to maximum distance. So uh, thanks for watching.
catch you on the next one.